Yo guys, it's Joe Billy Forty One here, and welcome back to part twenty-eight of Pokemon Video and Adventures. Now, as you can see, everybody, I believe, is still the same. Actually, no, I leveled up a couple of them, like one by off-screen. Got like plus was fifty, some of the forty-eight and whatnot. And yeah, we're just gonna explore where this leads to. So right here, we have this trainer. Why are you riding a Pokemon? Can't you swim? Sort of. Well, I, I that's what slaves are for. Yeah, these Pokemon here are weak. They're in the high 20s, 30s, and stuff, whatnot, so this would be pretty easy. So I just Brick Break this, because Brick Break owns horses. Yeah, Brick Break for the win, and yeah, barely get any HP, or EXP, whatever. Has another horsey, so I Brick Break that. Oh, and uh, if you're in case you're wondering, this is, I'm still recording this on Halloween, and there's still kids knocking on my door, annoying the shit out of me. So yeah, now, here comes the Seedra. Ugh. So I'm like, oh, okay, Brick Break ain't gonna kill it. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. I do more than half. And then it does a lit. Oh, no, wait, this one's not the one that gave me trouble. Oh, wait, is it? Like, oh, annoying me. I Brick Break again. Oh, yeah, they're here. I Brick Break again for the kill. And I, hold on, and I get... F Never mind. I am stupid. I should know this stuff before I'm recording it. And I just recorded this like a half hour ago. Wow. Never mind. And he brings out another horse scene and I just break break for the kill. Because that's what Power Outage does. She turns the lights off for all of them. Yeah. I don't know how long this beta goes on for. I thought, I thought it just goes after the Elite Four. But apparently it goes on for longer. But, hmm. We'll see. Anyway, here's Shirley. Oh yeah, here, and he has this. This person has Cedra. Level thirty. So I'm like, oh okay, I don't think a brick break can kill it, but thunder misses, and he brings out a. F it goes a freaking smoke screen. I'm like, oh, oh smoke screen, smoke screen, whatever. It, thunder misses again, of course, and then he water gun. Sorry about that. And uh, brick break, and it freaking misses, and he bubbles, which is like, fuck you. I think bubble is actually most u like should be the most useless move because it's just bubbles. Come on, and I get a brick break off, and I get freaking poison. So I'm like, what the fuck? And he smoke screens again. So I'm like, okay, I got two smoke screens on me, poison. Um, okay, I gotta switch out. So but I'm on. I brick break again, and I freaking miss. And he does another smoke screen. So I'm like. That's just a boner kill. Fuck you. So yeah, now I decide to switch out. And I switch out to Cutie. Because it's so cute. And the cuteness will take out all of his Pokemon. And P and thanks to its ability, Keen Eye, it does not lower my accuracy. So Slam is easier to hit, which does hit. And I get the experience on that. And here comes the Horsey, which won't do that much. I mean, not even going to do anything, Slam's, not even going to do anything, Slam's going to kill it. And, yeah, oh, shit, my, my, I, like, I keep holding it too low, and, like, keep holding it too high, so I have to, like, put it at the right part. So here comes this, another C draw, and Slam kills it, so I'm, and no poison, so I'm like, sweet. So, yes, Shirley gets defeated, quit it! I'm going to drown, you bitch. So yeah, uh, yeah, I just keep Bamfos in fun while I'm losing HP. Uh, wild Pokemon. Wild Pokemon. Yow. Sorry about that. And yes, he has another swimmer up here, so I just run into him. Would you take part in a sea? What? I don't even remember what he said. And how is he wearing that and doing that in the ocean? I don't know. So here comes a core fish, and I have power outage. Maybe I should put uh, rain dance on this thing. So thunder will always hit. Maybe when I get to Elite Four, I'll do that. I don't even remember what the last gym is. I gotta find that out. Shit. So yeah, I take out that core fish easily. Core fish is a really cool Pokemon. Oh, and if you're wondering what my favorite Pokemon is, my favorite Pokemon's Kingler. And like Krabby. Both of them are my favorite. I love them both. And then other ones is is, is actually uh Corefish and Crawdon. They're they're my two favorite evolutions and whatnot. I love them, like crabs. 
Yeah, so Thunder takes that out. Or was that? Pre- yeah, I think that was Thunder that takes that out. And these trainers right here, was like, I hate you. Like, I hate you. It's split up. And they just both walk in separate directions. Are like, you on vacation too? Yes, I'm on vacation. And the hotel I'm staying at is Victory. Okay, that was gay. So yeah, he <laughs> she brings out a tentacle. And I thunder it, so I'm like... Brr, 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 and it dies. So I'm like, sweet. Tentacle down. I want to just tell you right now, I don't verse the other person. Because of time and whatnot. Okay, here comes a horsey. Like, horsey! Uh, yes. Alright. Question of the day. What is your favorite Pokemon? Yeah, like I said, my my favorite Pokemon is Kingler. Oh, watch this. Twister. 5 HP. Ha! <laughs> so, okay. Anyway, yeah, my favorite Pokemon is Kingler. What is your favorite Pokemon? Leave a comment or video response if you want. I don't know why you would make a video response for me, but comment or video spo- response down below. Pointing my finger below if you don't know. And not at my dick. What? So anyway, I f- try to thunder here. Friggin' miss. And look at this ore beam. I'm like, oh no, it's gonna kill me. It's gonna kill me. It's gonna kill me. It does 5 HP. And the poison can- Well, actually, I'm 16 levels higher and a pretty nice special attack, so yeah, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. So, for lows, I just bring out free attacks for who has 6 HP and just crunch it to death. Yeah, I didn't want to verse the other person because of time and whatnot. And for the next episode, I think I level up somewhat off screen. Like, only, like, a couple of... I'm sorry I keep doing this, but, like, I really need to, and I don't have the time or patience to do it on screen, because it's really annoying, and it really pisses me off at times. And, he, uh, of course, he lives with a little bit, and he rests, so I'm like, oh, my God, I wasted another two turns. So, yeah, if I don't have to feed that camper or whatnot, and I'll defer that other person, because she's a bitch. She's a bitch. So, I have Zatu fly me to, uh, Seashore City. And then I go back to my house, and I'm like, Daddy, Daddy, I'm home. Hi, Daddy. He's like, hi, son, let me take care of you. And the lights go dark, it goes dark, and we don't know what they're doing. Yeah, be careful out there. All right, I'm going. It's like, what's up? <laughs> Gunfire, dead. Shot in the middle of the street. By uh, gangster Squirtles. I don't know, gangster Charmanders are cool. Or, or both of them, Squirtles and Charmanders. And what's weird, people do not know about the gym. You don't have to verse any, you don't ha- actually do not have to verse any trainers. Look, you just cut through there. Yeah, you just cut through there. You go You go over here. You don't jump on that island like I did for being a friggin' idiot. And you go down here, and there's the gym wheel. You actually do not have to verse any trainers. But I would recommend for experience. So yeah, all my Pokemon are healed. So yes, next time on Pokemon Vigion Adventures... Hopefully we'll be able to take on the gym leader and hopefully be able to beat this bitch once and for all. So, I will see you guys in part 29.